For those who didn't know, I stream every single day at twitch.tv slash Walla. We just hit 70,000 followers. And if you could drop a follow, I would greatly appreciate it. Thank you. Hey, what's going on guys? Walla here. In today's video, we're going to be using the Icefall Mantle Titan Exotic Gauntlets. I've never used these before, and I think I've only ran into this one time. I play a lot of trials, and the only time I'm doing Rumble is for a video, obviously, so I don't really run into these that often. For those who don't know what this does, instead of a barricade, you replace it with an overshield you put on top of yourself. The only downside is every time you have the overshield on, you can't regenerate your barricade until the overshield is gone, which is actually a good thing thing because it'd be really broken if you could and you actually slow people if you pop this next to someone so that's pretty cool too you cannot run around when you have the overshield on as well which is cool i guess cool as in it's a good balancing thing but i don't know how it's going to translate in game i'm going to be using the messenger with this i just thought i'd switch it up i was tempted to use the dmt but i think we're going to stick with the messenger i'm going to play sunbreaker just because i make sunspots every time i kill someone with an ability and it kind of just makes sense since i'm going to be playing a little bit slow as well and yeah i'm pretty excited i don't typically typically use new exotic pieces just because I'm very very stubborn when it comes to movement and I always love having dune marchers on but I think it's a good change of pace to try out new things so I'm going to be trying to use different exotic pieces from now on as well so if you guys have any other exotic pieces you want me to try out let me know in the comments down below and I'd greatly appreciate it with that being said let's get into the gameplay I hope you guys enjoy Okay, here we go. I don't like that you're in third person for a second after popping it. I'm gonna need this guy out. 52 damage. All right, here we go. Slowly but surely, here we go. Oh, all right. Here we go. Okay, I can't sprint. For those wondering, it does not let you sp sprint with this thing. It's actually very, very depressing. I'm gonna jump up and then maybe he'll come back. I did not have any shoddy ammo, but it worked out anyways. Okay, thank you, dude. We got sunspot proc. I'm going to see if uh, someone will challenge us from here. Just kind of waiting. There we go. Dude, if we get a sunspot proc with Desperado, forget about it. He didn't get hit by the nade. Oh my god. It feels really weird being able to sprint. I'm going to melee that guy. Someone's behind us. What? I didn't get him? There we go. Okay, I'm going to proc the Zonic now. Here we go. Someone's in front of us. Okay, just like that. His bow didn't do any... Well, it still did a lot of damage, but not as much as it should have. I don't have the overshield anymore, unfortunately. But we were able to run now at the very least. Dude, the, the movement is so bad with this. I hate it. It's so weird. But I want to try some new stuff because I always use movement exotic. So this should be it's still kind of fun. He might drop. He's up top on the right. We'll see if we can push him. The last word guy I was assuming would have won that, but I guess not. I have the Icefall Mantle Exotic again. I'm going to wait till someone spawns up. Here we go. Someone is behind us as well. Hopefully these guys kind of fight it out and we'll be good. I hear last word. Assuming the last word guy is going to win. Oh my god, I got two of them. Never mind. Dude, are they really just sitting here and waiting? Can you pop this in the air? I wonder. Someone is still back here. There we go. Dude, oh my god. I feel like such a noob. Here, let me test if you can pop this. No, you can't. Why would you be able to pop it in the air? I don't even know why I asked that. You can't pop a normal shield in the air. The good thing about this is that you can pop it, like, pretty far back. Because it lasts for so damn long. Which is really, really nice. Get that guy with Desperado. We're rocking it again. He's gonna come this way. Here we go. Someone's on the bottom. He's going for heavy ammo. Let's pop on him. I don't know what he's going to be using. He has some sort of LMG. Okay, he's dead. I don't know how, where the... Oh, the ammo's still there. There we go. The one is in front of me too. <laughs> Goodbye. I can see you. What? Hello? Aren't you going to try to do something about it? There we go, just like that. I didn't really get to use it to its full extent. I don't know. I mean, the only thing is you don't get it when... Uh, you can't charge your shield when you have the overshield proc, but it helped me out a few times that game. That was, that was the first game I actually got it to go pretty well, so I'm happy with that. For those who want to support me and go the extra mile, I have my own advanced GG code, code Walla. You get 10% off at checkout, and if you're interested, there's a link in the description down below. Thank you.
We're going to be using the DMT because it just makes sense since I can't run around or anything. Just walking around with the DMT is already a very, very, like, turbo virgin move. So, that's what we're going to do. We got... We don't have the overshield anymore. I don't have to walk around. Dude, I literally will still be walking even though the overshield's gone just because I don't realize it. I'm so used to just walking around. Ooh, he already has this week. We're going to back up here because we are at the disadvantage already. You're going to be seeing me with my shoddy out while running a lot more often just because I don't have dune marchers on. And since I do have lightweight on the shotgun, I move faster. So why not? We're going to proc the overshield. I don't know if this guy behind us is going to challenge us anytime soon. That guy's AFK. I think he might. We can't run, so no rush. Someone's middle outside. Did he jump up top? He's going to be pushing us here. We do have an overshield. We're going to walk towards him. All right, cool. We still have the overshield procs, and we took no damage. So we're going to have to wait the whole duration. All right, overshield's gone. We can move again. Someone is behind us. Got that guy. I feel kind of dirty using this gun, but it just it just makes sense. It just makes so much sense to use it. I don't know if I'm going to use it twice in a row, but at least one game. Someone's in front of me. Oh my god. I thought maybe he'd spawn in with his primary. This guy was ready. Up in the OS right off the rip here. Oh yes. Being able to outgun heavy ammo feels good. You're dead. Thank you. We got the sunspot. We can two tap this guy. Goodbye to you. Anyone else outside to two tap? Perhaps. Someone's bridge. Two tap that guy. Someone's gonna be on my right side. Two tap you or one tap. We'll take it. I'm waiting for my uh, overshield. I kind of want to proc it before I keep killing everyone. <laughs> he has Lord of Wolves. We're going to back up here. He is going to be chasing us. We can get a... Oh, I thought he'd be chasing us. We're going to pop the overshield. Someone's on my left. Someone's middle. There goes the overshield. We're going to pop hammers here. and just going to float in the corner since we are weak. Okay, we're good. That guy's over here. You're dead. Where, where were you going? I thought he was going to like try to crouch for a little bit. Someone should spawn here though. Is he going to try to kill me? You're dead. You're dead. Thank you. Anyone else? We're going to nade middle unless he doesn't push it. I'm going to run through the sun spot again. We got two tap potential. Nade this guy. We got a 120 tag. That was big. Is he going to run towards us? Yes, he is. We'll pop the overshield for one more kill. And you're dead. Wow, that was really good. Holy crap. Dude, DMT is not fair, man. <laughs> I mean, it really isn't. With this uh, with this exotic uh, gauntlet, it actually works really well together since you can't really move around when you pop it. This is good. We're going to pop it right away since we did spawn out here. We're using the Vex now. What up, J-Rod? Someone else is on my right side. We still have the overshield proct. What's he going to do? On top. Okay. Very clever. Nice. We still got basically the whole overshield. Dude, someone's banging on the on the, on the the ceiling. What is that? All right. Someone's making a lot of noise just now. I think we're good. I still have the overshield proct. That's like four kills now. Overshield kind of helped us right there. Thanks. He did like two damage. Wait, the shield didn't... Every time I get a kill, it like extends? Oh, I don't know how I feel about that. I just realized, I think if you swap weapons, does the overcharge go away? Yeah, it does. I don't really like the Vex uh, overcharge perk anyways, but I didn't really... That was for science right there, okay? I didn't even realize. We got a fellow Vex user. We're going to steal that. We're going to run away. We're going to come back now. What's the play here, dude? Oh my god. I got some nasty ghost bullets right there for a second. I need to pop this overshield right away. No! Can we get this guy? Dude, what is going on? I feel like half my bullets aren't registering. I know it's just, just you know, a YouTuber complaining, but I'm serious. I feel like my bullets aren't registering. I'm gonna get out of here. Did some decent damage to this guy. My guy's dead. I have no health. I'm so screwed. Melee him for the uh, extra damage. There we go. Okay, we got the thing frogged. Can I body shot someone in this? Hmm. I thought maybe I'd be able to body shot him. He did have an overshield though. But even without the overshield, I only did like 170 something. So clearly you can't body shot with it. Oh, that guy died. That sucks. I'm going to pop the overshield here. 
Let's see if I can get this guy. We do have 20 seconds. I'm not really too worried about getting someone right away, but I'd like to kill someone pretty soon. There we go. And we lost the overshield, which is kind of nice since I can run around now. Oh, wow. What is this, dude? What am I watching? Did I get both of them? I did. We're dead, though. Damn, I pulled the heavy. I should have used it. What do I even have on? No, never mind. That wouldn't have helped anybody. Whoa, I did not... Oh, I keep forgetting. My primary is uh, number two, not number one. Okay, you're dead. I'm waiting for my overshield. Oh, I want to test this out. If I pop overshield and pop my... Ah, oh, never mind. Okay, it doesn't work. That was for that was for science too. I was just trying to learn a little bit more about this exotic because I was only just popping it and running in. But I guess you lose it when you pop uh, super, which makes sense. I thought maybe like I just wouldn't be able to run in my super or something. I don't know. Hold that. Thank you. Oh, that's it. Game over. Sick. And good game. Wait, you can body shot them. What? Or maybe I had damage. Or maybe he damaged himself. I'm not too sure. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. That was pretty fun to do. Although I don't know if these are really worth it. The only time I felt like it was genuinely pretty solid was when I was using Dead Man's Tail, but it wasn't even the exotics. It was just Dead Man's Tail being Dead Man's Tail. But at least I got a pretty good game with Vex. That was my first game with Vex. It went really, really good. Same with DMT. I just played one game and it went pretty solid, so I can't complain about it. I was having a hard time with the messenger, but... Again, we still got a pretty good game with it. Before I go, I just wanted to apologize. A lot of people kind of got mad that I made a sponsored video. Uh, the last video I made was a sponsored video. And a lot of people were not very happy about that. If you guys really, really don't like me doing sponsored videos, that's something I will probably try to stay away from. I don't do them very often. That was only my second one ever. Just because I know it's annoying to be watching and then all of a sudden, bam, you're hit with a freaking, you know, two minute uh, ad about something. So I do understand it. But I just want to thank you guys for always watching the videos because it does mean a lot. And with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.